I remember the day in 2014 when you told me that you have been made the captain as MS Dhoni had decided to retire from the test cricket. I remember Dhoni, you and I having chat later that day and him joking about how quickly your bird will start turning grey. We all had a good laugh about it. Since that day, I have seen more than just your bird turning grey. I have seen growth, immense growth, around you and within you. And yes, I am proud of your growth as the captain of the Indian national cricket team and what achievements the team had under your leadership. But I am more proud of the growth you achieved within you. In 2014, we were so young and naive, thinking that just good intentions, positive drive and motives can take you ahead in life. They definitely do but not without challenges. A lot of these challenges that you faced were not always on the field. But then, this is the life right? It tests you in places where you least expect it to but where you need it the most. And my love, I am so proud of you for not letting anything come in the way of your good intentions. You led by example and gave winning on field every ounce of your energy to the extent that after some losses I have sat next to you with tears in your eyes while you wondered if there is still something more you could have done. This is who you are and this is what you expected from everyone. You have been unconventional and straightforward. Pretense is your foe and this is what makes you great in my eyes and the eyes of your admirers. Because underneath all this were your pure, unadulterated intentions always. And not everyone will be able to truly understand that. Like I have said, truly blessed are those who try to get to know you beneath what meets the eye. You are not perfect and have your flaws, but then again, when did you ever try to conceal that? What you did was to always stand up for doing the right thing. The harder thing, always. You held on to nothing with greed, not even this position. And I know that. Because when one holds on to something so tightly, they limit themselves and you, my love, are limitless. Our daughter will see the learning of these seven years in the father that you are to her. You did good.